I want a pet mouse. You do? Mice are dirty and messy. Not all of them. You want a mouse? Really? Yes. They are so cute. Cute? No way. They have big ears and eyes. Ugh! Don't remind me. And look at their long tails. No thanks. I hate their tails. Don't you like Mickey and Minnie? Yeah. Well, they're mice. But they're not real mice. Right. Real mice can run, jump, and climb. Can they swim too? Yes, they can swim very well. That's interesting, I guess. And mice can hear and smell very well. That's enough. I'm leaving. Do you like mice? Many people do not. Mice can be messy and dirty, but some people like mice. Mice can be cute. They have big ears, big eyes, and a long tail. Mice can jump, climb, and swim very well. They can run fast too. They eat a lot. They eat fifteen to twenty times a day. They can't see well, but they can smell and hear very well. Hello, 你喜欢老鼠吗？ Susie 在平板电脑上搜寻老鼠，因为她想养一只老鼠。Susie 说 ，I want a pet mouse. 名词 mouse 就是老鼠。Mouse 是单数，复数是 mice。一只老鼠是 one mouse。两只老鼠就是 two mice。James 觉得老鼠很脏。James 说 ，Mice are dirty and messy. 形容词 messy 就是脏乱的、杂乱的。Susie 可不这么认为，她觉得老鼠很可爱啊。Susie 说 ，They are so cute。形容词 cute 就是可爱的、逗人喜爱的。Susie 跟 James 说，米老鼠也是老鼠哦，但米老鼠不是真的老鼠，真的老鼠会跑、会跳、还会爬。那老鼠会游泳吗 ？James 问。Can they swim too? 动词 swim 是游泳、游水的意思。Susie 说，老鼠很会游泳。此外，它们的听力和嗅觉都非常灵敏。Mice can hear and smell very well. 动词 smell 是闻出、闻到的意思。I want a pet mouse. You do? Mice are dirty and messy. Not all of them. You want a mouse? Really? Yes. They are so cute. Cute? No way. They have big ears and eyes. Ugh! Don't remind me. And look at their long tails. No thanks. I hate their tails. Not all of them. Not all of them. 不是全部都这样 Ew! Mice are messy. Not all of them. Spiders are scary. Not all of them. Snakes are dangerous. Not all of them. Which one would make a good pet? Not all of them. Not all of them. 不是全部都这样 James 心目中的老鼠和 Susie 的可是天差地远 Susie 形容老鼠非常可爱 James 说 Cute? No way. 我们来看 No way 这个用法 No way 字面上看起来是没有路或是没有办法的意思。事实上 ，no way 的意思有很多，而且会随着说话的人的态度和语气有所不同。James 说 ，cute，no way。他的意思是
你说老鼠可爱才怪。当你的朋友想跟你借车，你可以说 No way， 意思是门都没有。如果你的好朋友告诉你他昨晚被求婚了，你说 No way， 意思是真的假的。如果你的朋友冲进来说他中乐透了，你可以说 No way， 意思是怎么可能？ No way， 在生活中很常用又非常的到位，请务必要试试看哦。Don't you like Mickey and Minnie? Yeah. Well, they're mice. But they're not real mice. Right. Real mice can run, jump, and climb. Can they swim too? Yes, they can swim very well. That's interesting, I guess. And mice can hear and smell very well. That's enough. I'm leaving. Susie 眉飞色舞的说着老鼠会做的事。James 会说 ，That's interesting. I guess. 既然有趣，应该是很喜欢。但是说到后来 ，James 直接离席了。怎么会这样呢？其实是他们彼此对 interesting 的体会不同。Interesting 这个字去查字典，意思是很有趣的。但老外在用这个字的时候，虚实不定，有时候是正面，有时候是负面，取决于情境。Interesting 这个字其实有两种意思，第一种是引起人兴趣的事，第二种是很奇怪、与众不同的意思。很多老外，特别是绅士派的英国人，当他要拒绝你的时候，他会说。That's interesting. 经常是表达这行不通的意思。这种优雅而不那么直白的幽默，你可别有听没有懂哦。Hey friends, it always makes me smile when I think of you. Well, I have something fun planned for today's use it. If you want to say that you are doing something, you can use today's use it. For example. I'm studying, or I'm going home. You can do this. Don't be afraid to use it. Mouse, mouse. A mouse is living in my apartment. Messy, messy. My little brother is messy. Cute. Cute. George has a cute dog. Swim, swim. Let's swim in the pool. Smell, smell. Can you smell the onions? I want a pet mouse. You do? Mice are dirty and messy. Not all of them. You want a mouse? Really? Yes. They are so cute. Cute? No way. They have big ears and eyes. Ugh! Don't remind me. And look at their long tails. No thanks. I hate their tails. Don't you like Mickey and Minnie? Yeah. Well, they're mice. But they're not real mice. Right. Real mice can run, jump, and climb. Can they swim too? Yes, they can swim very well. That's interesting, I guess. And mice can hear and smell very well. That's enough. I'm leaving. I like mice. I think they're nice. <laughs> you better think twice. Mice aren't nice. Yes, they are. Mice are cute. <laughs> mice are messy. They have cute ears and long tails. Ew! I hate their long tails. There is a mouse in our house. Wait, there is? <laughs> yeah, I saw it yesterday. It ran under the bed. <laughs> it did. Yeah, but don't worry. It was just a baby mouse. Oh, that's good. Yeah, a baby mouse and his brothers and sisters, and they'll grow up and run and jump and climb. Oh <laughs> no! Don't remind me. Maybe the 
brothers and sisters will be cute too. A family of mice in our house? Yeah. Oh, can we have a mouse house? <laughs> Because mice are nice. Oh no. Well, friends, it's Monday again, so let's answer some questions together. Here's your first question: Who doesn't like mice? Who doesn't like mice? You can find the answer in conversation A. James doesn't like mice. Here's your second question: What kind of pet do you want? What kind of pet do you want? Why don't we hear some answers from some of our friends? What kind of pet do I want? Actually, I've always wanted to have one of those very pretty lizards. I think lizards are actually very cool. They're called iguanas. They're big, and they have very beautiful scales on them. I like the colors, and they're also pretty relaxed. You can even let them walk around outside the tank. Also, sometimes if I have a furry pet, I'll sneeze a lot. But lizards don't have fur. What kind of pet do I want? Ah,、uh, I don't think I want a pet. Pets are cute and fun, but they're a lot of work. And I really like to travel. And it doesn't seem fair to have a pet if you're going to always leave it and go other places. But I guess if I had to have a pet, maybe I should have a fish. They don't take very much work, and I think you can leave them. What kind of pet do I want? Well, I already have dogs. And I already have birds, so I think my next pet will be a pony. Wouldn't it be cute to have a miniature horse? <laughs> it would be fun. You could invite children over to take a ride. You could、uh, walk with it through the neighborhood, and everyone would say, "Isn't that a cute little pony?" Yes. That's on my next list of pets to get.、Yeah. What kind of pets do I want? Pets make a great addition to any home. Although I like many kinds of animals, my favorite are probably dogs. Dogs make terrific pets. I enjoy getting outdoors and going for long walks, so a dog could easily join me for this kind of an activity. So, when choosing a pet, I think finding one that's also suitable to your hobbies and interests is important.